For Galeb, we did a lot of research in mood boards to define his personality and his various physical traits. Galeb is a Ventru. Ventru have a certain classiness and often wear a suit. So we decided to put him in a blue suit, the color of his clan. After establishing Galeb's clan and defining the main points of his character, we decided to individualize him further to give him depth. So we gave him rings and tattoos. Galeb is a Ventru, and ever since the beckoning when all the elders left Boston, he has been the oldest and therefore most powerful vampire in Boston. For his history, we made him a traveler to represent how you can grow weary of everything. Because Galeb, as an elder and the last one, is kind of worn down because the other elders ultimately left him. And he finds himself with all these neonates who are fighting amongst themselves for power. And the question Galeb asks himself is, does he want to join in this struggle for power or not? Galeb is the prince's right-hand man because he is very powerful and highly respected. She feels she needs him to keep the domain together. The problem is that he can also hear the beckoning. And he's in this state of indecision. Does he want to leave and join the other elders, or should he stay, help the prince and maybe change the situation? Galeb is the most powerful and oldest of the vampires still in Boston. We reflect this in-game by giving him an extra discipline. So the other characters have three disciplines while Galeb has four. This extra ability is consistent with the kind of vampires we encounter in literature. They are strong creatures, so Galeb is stronger. He has stronger physical and mental resistance. He can withstand many attacks, whether they are mental attacks from other vampires or physical attacks in missions when things can turn out badly. Therefore, Galeb is usually sent out on key Camarilla missions, missions that can be quite delicate where more interactions with mortals is needed because he's more used to that. And of course, he is trusted to intervene when there is a problem, so he is fairly free to make his own decisions because of his rather special status within the Camarilla. Galeb is definitely a warrior. He is very strong, a real problem solver. He's there to safeguard the Camarilla, but he's also the oldest and carries more burden on his shoulders. He's seen all the internal wars within the Camarilla. He's seen princes come and go. So he also carries this weight around, this disillusionment of what exactly is the benefit of this Camarilla society? Is this the end of the Camarilla? Is this the end for me? Galeb has class, a presence. He's very tough, very cold. But he's an old vampire, he has experienced many things, and this is what I like about him. He's a very powerful character, introverted and harbors a lot of pent-up anger. But for how long? 